Hey guys, Ricardo here and welcome to another blog tech tips. Of course, today guys, I'm going to show you how to fix the issue when after a iOS update or of course the latest iOS um, 14 or higher version, if you have updated and of course your apps are crashing, I'm going to show you how to fix um, these crashing apps. Now, of course, if you are having any particular app or group of apps that's crashing, um, it's simple to fix these apps. I'm going to show you what to do. So let's get straight into it. Now, let's say, for example, um, I'm going to just show, choose a random app. Let's say, for example, WhatsApp or maybe YouTube is crashing or whatever. Um, the first thing you're going to do, guys, is just go ahead and you're going to go to the App Store. Once you're in the App Store, guys, you're going to click are you going to go to um, search here? You're going to tap your user ID, which is your profile up here in the upper right. Once you tap, guys, once you're here, you're going to scroll down. And if you see updates right here, you're going to tap update. I've updated all of mine, but you, um, if there's no update, it will say open. If, it's, if there's an update, you'll see update. So go ahead and tap update. All right. And once you update these apps, so simply go ahead. All updates will be shown here. So you simply tap and update your apps. Um, a secondary way to do this would be to search for the app that's crashing. So let's say WhatsApp is crashing. You'd search for WhatsApp. And of course, you'll see update here. Go ahead and tap update and the app will update. Once the app updates, what should happen is that the bugs should be fixed and the crashes should stop. Now, of course, if that doesn't work, another option, guys, would be to uninstall the app. So let's say WhatsApp is the culprit. Go ahead and long press the app. And of course, once the app, um, so once you're here, guys, simply go ahead and hit remove app. So once you go ahead and say remove app, it will show you this. Notice it gives you the option. It says um, what you want to do with the app. It says move, uh, move WhatsApp to app library or delete app. Now, of course, if you move to app library, it would simply mean that you have removed it from the home, but it will be still in your app library. So not that option. So you're going to hit delete app. So once you choose um, delete app, um, you're going to go ahead and delete the app. I'm just showing you here. I'm not going to do mine. And then you're going to go back to the um, app store. Make sure that you're on um, the search tab. So if you're on today's tab, go over to search. Search for WhatsApp or whatever the app is. And you're going to see install. Go ahead and install the app. And of course, once you install the app afresh, after uninstalling it, remember to reboot your phone. It's a good idea to always reboot your phone because sometimes just refreshing will help. So reboot your phone, guys. Once you reboot, um, go ahead and go come back and launch the application. The app should start working again and the crashes should stop. It's also a good idea to keep up to date as well. Um, maybe sometimes there's an emergency bug fix. So it's always a good idea to, um, from here, quickly I regularly check if you have um, a lot of apps crashing software updates sometime apple will push out maybe an emergency update to fix particular bugs so it's always good to go to the most stable version so go ahead again and check if it's been a while since you have updated and of course the crashes started um, recently all right so if you do all of those things including reboot do not underestimate rebooting it does help a lot you should be able to fix the issue. Worst case scenario for a few people, you might have to do back up your device and do a reset. But of course, that's rare and in a few um, cases. But of course, um, that might be just only a last resort for a few people. So also keep that in mind. All right. So Ricardo Gardner from Block Tech Tips, as always, guys. And that's the quick tip showing you how to fix apps crashing after a major iOS update or, of course, after the iOS 14 update. Ricardo Gardner, see you in the next time. Bye, guys.